Hello everyone, uh, post-match reaction here after Liverpool draw, oh, Liverpool draw nil-nil with Blackburn at Prenton Park. Um, yeah, pretty frustrating to say the least. Um, obviously a couple of opportunities for Liverpool in that game to sort of take the lead. Um, I said mid-week in the podcast and during the build-up that Blackburn seems to be one of those teams that just love to frustrate us. Um love to get a draw against us and I think that's the last three games we've we've drawn against them. Um so not the best not the best results against Blackburn so far but um yeah overall I, th I thought we we were pretty much on top uh, uh throughout the throughout the game. Um the Blackburn had a couple of spells where they sort of had a, a decent amount of possession. Um I think their their plan today was just sort of to sit back and defend and as much as possible and try and catch us on the break or if they did have their, their spells of possession they just tried to um tried to hit us on the counter uh, which is which is what you what you sort of expect um when people come away way to us here printing but yeah um first half nothing really to shout about there was one moment towards towards the end of the half where Yana Daniels tries to get the volley um and it hits Richardson Square in the face really. Um so her height sort of benefited her there, um, which is what, what Daniel said herself post match. Um but yeah, obviously really frustrating to sort of end with a end with a draw. Um yeah. Obviously second half come out, um team looks riled up. We first first ten minutes we sort of um you know, try and hit hit them on the on the break as well and try and hit them really hard. We just ran clinical, clinical enough in front of goal today, which was really frustrating. Um, you know, we've been so clinical the last couple of weeks in in front of goal, especially the like slightly uncanny and whatnot. But today, Blackburn just just played their game plan really well. Um, there was a moment in the second half, Leanne Cannon, um the ball pretty much looked like crossed the net from me. Speaking to to Matt Beer post match, he said he's seen it back and it's crossed the line twice so frustrating really as you know Durham dropped points today and um, got beat 3-1 I think it ended against Crystal Palace so you know we've gained a point there but we could have gained three and it was just the officiating wasn't really the best there you know the fourth official can't even communicate with the ref on the pitch um to you know even when we were trying to make substitutions the ref didn't know unless someone went over and shouted at her basically to say, you know, someone wants to make a sub. So, yeah, um, just little things like that. That's still very frustrating, especially, you know, we un I understand that, you know, we're playing in the Women's Championship, but, you know, a bit of goal line technology wouldn't go amiss in terms of, of days like, like today because, you know, that's cost us three points there to say that, um, that decision. And if it's crossed the line twice, then... What more? What more do Liverpool need to do there? But yeah, it's not um, it's not not good to dwell on it. You know, it is what it is. A point gained, and um, so yeah, obviously look ahead to Durham next week now, which will be a really interesting game. Obviously with them dropping points, like I said. So, um, both teams will be very much up for that match. Um, unfortunately can't go away. Would have loved to have gone, but can't do it. But we there will be some reactions and post match and whatever else from that so um let's just hope that we can get a good result away at Durham and um, get some more points on the board. Another clean sheet again today which is really impressive from us. Um you know that back th back three slash five seems to be working a treat for Liverpool at the minute. Um so we've just got to make sure that we stay consistent with that. Um Durham will be a threat next week but you know we just have to have to try and keep strong on that and yeah hopefully Liverpool come away with a win but let me know your thoughts in the comments below about today's game Um, thank you very much for watching remember to like the video comment subscribe to the channel check out last week's podcast and some post-match interviews Yana Daniels will be up on the channel um, now so go and check that out and yeah thank you for watching I'll see you all next time with a new video bye